Let's see versus dirty. I don't like it, dirty. I don't like that mindset. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's like he decided to give up on every oh, method except for one. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Hey, tell me, she keeps, hey, keeps, keeps, keeps talking shit. I'm just gonna go. It's like, 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 Oh man, winner's finals. Yo, we got, we got some of Nortos <laughs> finest. We got Donnie Asian. Donnie versus Asian, not Donnie Asian. Alright, so we need uh, to. <coughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, we, uh, we got people not reacting to their tech chase, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, 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 coverage. Ooh, I like it. Mm. You want to move the camera? Yeah, that's great. Warmer? Uh, uh, you need to go this way. This camera needs to point him. He's not even on the shot. Warmer? Oh, hey. uh, no, bring it towards me. I, I did, and then you said uh, I said I, I, you gotta go like. Are we good? Better? Yeah, just put just put it back. Just, just leave it. Is it? <laughs> no, because. I don't think the camera's big enough to cover both of them. Nope, just kidding. You guys are best of uh, three. Oh, actually, that, that was way good. Oh, that's great. Okay. <laughs> we in there? Okay, it moved a little bit, but, like, I'm not going to spit. You know, like, when you're getting your hair cut and you, like, take, take a little bit too much off the one side? <laughs> like, I'm, yeah. I'm not going to sit here and, and do All that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> well, Fox oh. things. Was that, was that mm. SDI out to the platform? I did not expect... You know, I did not expect this uh, level of nuance. Hmm. I didn't catch it. Hmm. Oh, no, oh, more fox things. That, nope. Dude, did you ever read um, History of a Smasher by Chillin' Dude? I think that's what it's called. No. Dude, I, well, I mean, technically I haven't either, but I, I've read through certain parts of it. Like, I read through him when, like, uh, like the first time he discovered, like, the up throw up air on Marth. <laughs> and he was just like, this is like, the, it was a game changer, dude. Because you know, it was Ken back then. Yeah. And they're like, oh, we have the surefire way to kill a Marth? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh man. The, I wanted, I, I guess the down air was just a little out of school. Ooh. Yeah. Man. Ooh. Oh, I like all of this. That was pretty good. Not expecting like some like, some swag, like the reverse back air. Because he was kind of like pretty dude. close up there, you know? Yeah. Nah, dude, I, I'm, I'm not about the swag, dude. Like, if it ha Okay, well, there's a copy end that. But, like, you should do what it takes to defeat your opponent. Yeah. But you for, you forgot who you're co-commentating with. Man, <laughs> man who tries jink at any, at any point. Please, Misto. Misto, this is why this is why you're, like, ninth and not, like, third. <laughs> Wait, where are you? The, uh, I'm 14th on, uh, on Stammy's rankings. On Stammy's. The, okay. Although I, I feel like that needs a huge asterisk. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we need to talk about the actual game. The, we're, we're talking about the game. We're talking we're about we're the, we're the talking fight about the of the ages. But we're not talking about Marth this versus game. Fox. This is this, this one actually of the, one of my favorite matches to watch. Yeah, like this is almost uh, archetypical as a uh, Fox versus Falco. This is just this is in our bones, dude. <laughs> it's the, it's the grounds of which melee was built. Yeah. <laughs> no, I the whole discussion on, uh, which one S 64. Yeah, yeah, oh goodness. Like the fact that, this, that the discussion is even happening. I like, I like how he put himself like underneath the platform to react with a double jump aerial to any given direction of which Fox tagged. Yeah, dude. But then he just wasn't fast enough. Yeah, and then that's the rough thing when you make the correct decision, but you're just not technically proficient enough to, to do anything about it. Mm -hmm. Rough life. I, I know that life. I, do you know how many times I've stood under someone and been like, there's nothing they can do that I can't react to. And then they do the thing I can react to and I get hit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, whoops. Looks like they got some more power shoots. So soon we'll be uh, going to play some friendlies. Yeah, dude. The, uh, and then then uh, we'll have slight less commentary. The, yeah. Uh, <laughs> It's fine. No, no, the Norta boys will be able to get, get rid of our, our uh, southern. I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm just, I'm just saying. Just saying words. Yeah, basically, okay. I'm saying that, we're, that that this usually doesn't happen. That this is a uh, uh, like being able to play against some uh, some strong opponents from the north is going to be fun. 
Yeah. And it's, not, it's something that you don't always get to do because it takes just a little bit more energy to get up here than yeah. uh, some of the other tourneys. It's fine. It's fun that they have the events up here. Yeah. It's just, uh, always, a, always a good time. Yeah. So, like, some of the regions in Utah uh, have, have developed... Sub-regions. Yeah, like, like you know that little thing in science class where they talked about like the like the gray and the red squirrels, and they're only that color because they're separated because they by a landmass. No, sorry. But you you never went over divergent evolution. Maybe I just don't remember. Gosh dang it, Misto! If you see, you'd have to explain more because I I never heard about the gray and red squirrel. Well, it's ever. like <laughs> okay, so it's like there was one population of squirrels, and then like millions, this is way too long for commentary. <laughs> well, Bas basically, there was a mountain range between two populations, and because of that, they became two different species? Yeah, okay. essentially. Right. Well, this is still like, <laughs> and basically that whole long 90 second spiel was describing why you'll see you'll see differences in gameplay when you when uh, when you're in the northern parts of Utah <laughs> yeah. compared to the the central parts and even the southern parts. I always I always love mm. to see the way that uh, the SOTA players play. Do you think if we had like a the, a monthly that a lot of players came to more the subregions of like that they would you would come closer together so then their styles they would come closer right? <laughs> so that way if you have subregions these guys will still play kind of more like, I don't know, Central Utah because they play Central Utah more. Yeah. So, uh, that's what has to happen if they do play more together, right? Yeah, yeah. If they, if they played more together, the, the styles would be would be more similar. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, there'd probably still be some, like, like the similarities, the differences would probably yeah. be, still be there, just not as pronounced. Yeah. Because, like, sometimes, like, sometimes, like, you play a player and they're, like, and they're from, like, a particular region, and you're like, oh, they have this gaping hole in their play because yeah. they've never had to fix it. The SoCal? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like West Coast versus West Coast? That's like a, a big one that people used to talk about. Do you guys want real commentary? Yeah. If, if you want a real commentary. Oh, man. man, somebody's bringing the technology in. They're not going to sound terrible. All right, let's see. Where can we plug this piece? Probably on that side. They got a mouth. <laughs> Take out your gamer mouse. Oh man, I feel like we just like min maxed an RPG build. Get rid of this useless thing that we don't need. We actually gets him for that. It's actually really good. Let's go. Perfect. There you guys go. Thanks, dude. All right. We, I love how we got the mic, but we also got power, so this is probably going to be short-lived. Yeah. They're not up yet, though. So All right. Cool. It's a 1-0 Donnie, I think. I'm pretty oh, no. sure. If Don, is Don, Donnie's the mark. Donnie's the fox. Our bad guys. Well. The, it's, alm shit. it's almost like we're not from here. <laughs> <laughs> I try to base it off their... Uh... Wait. You didn't see... Oh, no. They... No, sorry. I don't remember that. I just remember the like, ICs. Anyways, I try to base it off their port color and their controller color without actually looking at the cords. So I glanced over to the right and saw Donnie was having a Y controller and then he looked at the GameCube and saw a Y controller cord. He's like, oh. Oh, man. But then has a white cord. We got, yeah, we got some Frankenstein controllers up here. Yeah. So I, I got bodied, is what I'm trying to say. Oh. Ooh. I don't agree. I, like, I'm not a Marth, but I didn't like that. Oh, I like that. Okay, that, like... So, like, he salvaged the situation, right? But I yeah. feel like... Mar like the fox should have just died off the left blast zone. I feel like there was a setup somewhere yeah. in there. But again, I don't play that character. I just, I just see. Mr. Marth, this is Marth is uh, not a joke. <laughs> Are you sure, Misto? <laughs> it's, it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I, I got you. It does okay versus uh, Logos Fox. What? <laughs> Man, they're they're apparently they're playing defensive on uh, on another setup. All right. Hmm. Ooh. All right. Marth. That 
Marth tried to catch like Fox like short hopping in, yeah. but then Fox full hop and then put Marth put an aerial there, forcing Marth to be there because Marth kind of a slow character in general right. in the air. Now, if Marth would have just dashed away, it would have just been like so good. Like Fox is trying to mix up when he's going in, and that's why he caught him. Yeah, 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 dude. Sometimes you just gotta know when to bail when you're playing this game. Yeah. Just gotta be like, yeah, this situation didn't work out. Yeah. Ooh, caught him. <laughs> oh, that platform totally messed him up. Oh. That was that was like when your opponent thinks one too many levels and then and then you just stand there and grab them. That was that was what that was. Yeah. My favorite situation is when you're just uh, both in shield. Yeah. Oh. And you're just staring at each other. The most honest situation in melee. Yeah. But your both reaction times are so slow because you think of it like you know too long. Yeah. You're like oh he's in shield I can just shield grab him. But you're just like ah. <laughs> just a panic. Dude. Mm. Oh, oh, uh, all right. The... Ooh, I like this. Okay. These are some good decisions that are being made today. Which decision was that, Bill? The, so, Explain like, the, the fox the fox was, like, guarding the ledge, and the Marth, the Marth was on ledge, and usually in this situation, somebody makes a terrible mistake. Like, either the Marth goes too far on the stage, or, like, the fox stands too close to ledge. But no, this fox is, like, kind of between center stage and the ledge. And because of that, anything the Marth did from ledge was like relatively reactable. Now right. there, um, there are some things that the Marth could have done um, to, to be a little, be a little safer, be a little trickier. Maybe to like try to try to bait something a little bit more. But the fox is being particularly yeah. passive, so it would have been hard. I think yeah, either Marth needs to be more patient, or just needs to be faster in general. I got you, dude. The fox is you know waiting in between those, right? Which is which is trying, you know, the Marth trying to beat, you know, like the. I don't know. Yeah, like notably, it looks like this fox only aims and for the spot that's slightly in front of Marth. He doesn't really uh, just do something within his space or do something that super overshoots, which like should be a, a like a macro problem in the match. But I haven't been like seen the Marth. Uh, get a lot of mileage. He's got some. He's gotten some grabs off that kind of play. Yeah. Oh, I wanted to see the reverse forward air into downer. <laughs> I saw it. Like Fox is right above you like that. Yeah, the, the, the optimal. Maybe. I don't know how optimal, but in my mind it'd be optimal. Yeah. It'd be sick. Dude. I just want to say for, for the record, Misto, this was... Uh, um, uh, you should have air dodged. That's close. This was the commentary that, that I offered one of our larger events to get uh, get venue fee off, and uh, and that was declined. So 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 now we got to we, we got the practice boys. Yo wait, is that Donnie Asian? Isn't that best of five? Yeah. Play game three. 